Well, it just could be a first. An indoor park, Kamehameha Schools, unveiled plans for the unique space today in Kaka'ako. And as KITV4's Ann Sterling reports on a wet day like today, some say an indoor park is just what the community needs. It's all new at 6. It doesn't look like much now, but in just a couple of months, the goal is to turn this empty warehouse into this, an indoor park. We really need an in indoor space where people can hang out, think, collaborate, and grow and, and, and build community, and this, this is that place. The unique public gathering space will be located in a warehouse on Cook Street. As you can see, the plan is to make it a free, public, shaded gathering spot called Kaka'ako Agora. We want arts to be a highly prominent part of this community, so this is a great example of how we're doing that. Kaka'aka Waterfront Park is only a couple of blocks away from this proposed indoor park, but on a day like today, organizers say that's why there is a need for this indoor park. And this is for everyone, you know, I mean, young and old, theatrical productions to comedy, you know, a videography to... Um, speaker series on startups and venture capital. I mean, you can just imagine it and it, it should be able to occur in this space. And that includes being a space where, that can be used for just sitting down and opening up your laptop and tapping into the free Wi Fi that's going to be available in this neighborhood soon and doing some of your creative work, whether you're editing something on your computer or writing down some notes. The indoor park is just part of a massive redevelopment plan. Kamehameha Schools is rebuilding nine city blocks between South Street and Ward Avenue. Avenue. The goal is to make the area a mixed use, mixed income neighborhood that will include high rises and shops. We hope we're done with the physical construction over the next 11 years, but we'll be committed and stewarding this neighborhood forever. Ann Sterling, KITV 4 News. Now, the indoor park still needs approval from the Hawaii Community Development Authority, and that first hearing on the project is set for tomorrow morning. Might be something nice in the rain. Yeah. <laughs>